It's possible a large earthquake could hit right here in southern Arizona. In the shadow of the Santa Rita Mountains lies a fault capable of the big one. Here's News 4 Tucson's John Patrick with more. Well, this is it. It really doesn't look like much, but geologists say the Santa Rita Fault that's about 10 miles from the city of Tucson is capable of producing a 7.0 magnitude earthquake. Originally from California, Cece and Leroy Vaughn have lived through their fair share of earthquakes. All our cupboards opened up. Everything in the house just came coming down. That was a 6.8 magnitude quake CC remembers. Little did they know their Corona de Tucson home was built right next to a fault capable of producing an earthquake just as large. It's not something you'd expect, I wouldn't think. But I know, you know, the, the West is covered with earthquake faults. The fault has not ruptured in recent history, but there is evidence known as a fault scarp that a large earthquake has occurred in the past. Today, it looks a lot like a gentle slope, but at the time, it would have been a dramatic feature. The basin in the Tucson then would drop down five or ten feet relative to the Santa Rita Mountains. That's, that's what goes on in these kinds of large earthquakes. The most recent large earthquake to impact southern Arizona was in 1887. A magnitude 7.2 hit 50 miles south of Douglas, killing 51 people. An earthquake on this fault would impact hundreds of thousands of people. There would be widespread uh, damage in, in the Tucson area for sure because this isn't that far away from Tucson. Even though the Santa Rita Fault is considered active, geologists say the chances of it producing a strong earthquake in our lifetime are pretty small. From Corona Day Tucson, I'm John Patrick, News for Tucson.